On February 9, 2012, Rhiannon Tuptitian and Madison Vorva were given the Forest Hero Award by the United Nations Forum on Forest Secretariat for working to raise awareness about the links between unsustainable palm oil production and habitat destruction in rainforests since they were 11 years old. When Rhiannon and I began our journey five years ago, we started with one simple goal, to earn a Girl Scout Bronze Award by raising awareness within our local community about the endangered orangutan. We didn't set out to advocate for sustainability within the entire palm oil industry. We set out to advocate for a single species. But as our campaign grew, we discovered that palm oil is not only detrimentally impacting the inhabitants of Indonesia and Malaysia, but also is produced in other tropical regions of the world, including South America. We started very small. We wrote an email to the Girl Scout headquarters, and then when we realized that a single email wasn't going to do anything, we started a letter writing campaign. We did a petition, which we had our hero, Dr. Jane Goodall, sign. <laughs> Palm oil production has resulted in the loss of thousands of acres of rainforests worldwide and is continuing to expand at a rapid rate. The amount of land used for palm oil plantations in Southeast Asia has tripled in over a decade. As we looked around our houses, we realized that palm oil was an ingredient in everything from our shampoos and cosmetics to candy bars and baked goods like the Girl Scout cookies we had sold since childhood. And we'd been, you know, part of this Girl Scout organization since we were both five. So we thought, you know, we'll work within the organization and ask them to live up to their mission statement, which is to make the world a better place and to use resources wisely. Sometimes when we're, we're talking on the phone with people, they'll be like, well, we knew you were young, but we never realized that, like, you guys actually knew what you were talking about. So I think people have always realized from day one that we're young. What they don't really realize is that just because we're young doesn't mean that we don't have something to say. You know, we've been working on this campaign for five years to ask the Girl Scouts to use a sustainable source mm -hmm. of palm oil. Mm -hmm. And this past fall, they announced a new palm oil policy, which was a great step in the right direction. Um, still not quite the solution, but we're working with them. We're trying to keep our campaign positive. Even though palm oil hasn't been removed from Girl Scout cookies yet, we have made significant headway. Through this campaign, we are working to have the largest impact possible by pressuring Kellogg's, who bakes the Girl Scout cookies, and Cargill, the palm oil supplier, to adopt sustainability policies. While we aren't experts or even adults, we have a role to play in this movement. Our role has been to show consumers the connection between the products they buy here in the United States and destruction of tropical forests on the other side of the globe. As consumers, we must evaluate the way in which we exhaust our planet's resources. Because if we don't consider the impacts our decisions have on local and global communities, it is easy to ignore the destruction that occurs.